Oh my god, they're waiting for me. You guys, the ultimate pranksters. Whoa, 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 whoa. No way! No way, it's going again! What's happening? Oh my god, it's so beautiful! It's so beautiful! What is that thing in the sky? It's holding it back, guys. Whatever that is, it's holding it back. All right, guys, so today we're going to be playing one of the most unique games I've played in years. This is The Eternal Cylinder. It is out now. Now, I think a lot of what I could say about the game doesn't do it justice. You kind of have to see what it's all about for yourself. But if I had to boil it down, this is a game that throws you into an alien world as a little tiny creature called a Trebhum. It turns out these creatures, along with your world itself, is under threat by a giant cylinder. Something is pushing the cylinder along the ground and destroying the world as you know it. Now, occasionally you do get a break from the cylinder. You could set up barricades that hold it back for a little bit, but eventually it always starts rolling again. So there is a very deep story behind this game that unlocks along the way as you play through it. And I found that there's lots of little things to find as well, including over 50 different mutations for your creatures. Yes, you can actually control more than one creature. You patch them along the way or you might find one that's injured. And if you manage to keep it alive or resurrect it if it falls, you'll be able to take them along with you for the ride. Now I could go on and on about the game, but I feel like words won't do it justice, so let's go ahead and jump in. And guys, do be sure to click that link down below to check out The Eternal Cylinder for yourself. It is out now, and thank you to The Eternal Cylinder for sponsoring this video. So be sure to show them some love, but guys, we're going to jump right into it. We're going to start with Chapter 2, which gives a bit of a peek as to what's going on and causing the destruction of the world. This was a place of death and nothingness. There were no answers to be found here. The voice and their memories urge them to return to the lands of the What living. is that? Oh my god, what the heck? And why does they have a giant screen? What is that thing? Oh god. Do not get stomped, okay. So this this save that we have starts us off with three little creatures. But serious oh my god, dude! His right leg has legs! What is that thing? What the heck? And it was pushing along the cylinder. So when you first play this game and you play through the tutorial, you see what the cylinder does to anything that rolls over it. What we're getting a peek at now is what happens after the cylinder's been pushed all the way. Nothing remains. So we are playing as the Trap Hum, and this is a little tiny creature that can evolve over time. You can suck up these sort of crystals, by the way. If Anytime you see these in the game, you want to absorb them because they're how you actually revive your little friends if they ever get knocked out. Now, we need to figure out what's going on here because I've never actually seen this side of, of the cylinder. So this is chapter two. Technically, it's a little bit past the tutorial, but obviously the game is giving a bit of a clue as to what's going on. By the way, this is where you fill up on water. You do have to eat. You can notice a little stomach over there. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. What is this? What is this? Okay, so this is how you evolve in the game. Certain materials you find will show that they could be consumed to evolve. Whoa. Inflatable body? This balloon-like body allows a trepum to float in the air at will. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, that's cool. So what I need to do, I need to switch to another character. We're gonna suction up one of these other ones. Make sure he eats- Oh god! What the hell is that?! No! What? Okay, uh, I forgot to tell you guys, this is a very, very dangerous world. Oh my god. Oh my god, we gotta get out of here. Uh, is, is this where we- Okay, yeah, yeah, this is a floating- Oh god, what? Let me float up! It's still abducting my friends! We gotta go. We gotta go. That thing's gonna end up killing one of our little guys. Oh no! Oh my god! Is it- it's not dead, right? Roll away, roll away. Oh my god, I have never seen that creature before. Oh! I, I can see salvation! Okay, guys, we gotta float our way over here. This is what the actual game looks like. When you're not behind the cylinder- Oh god, am I gonna make it? <sighs> Whew! Okay. Guys, please tell me you made it. Come here. Come on. Wow, okay, I've not seen this biome really so much. What is that? 
Oh my god, it just snatched up one of my little guys! A profound feeling of futility overcame the Trevor. Despite having miraculously survived their encounter with the mathematician, they were back to where they'd started. Oh, oh, I can evolve with this too. To make matters worse, ahead of them lay the cold and snowy lands of the tundra. Not a very Ooh. nice place for Trevum, who were not meant to live in the cold. They would have to push forward against all odds and pray that they could find help. Oh my god. What is going on? By the way, this game has amazing music. So, we almost died there, guys. We legit almost died. Oh, what is this area? So, I've never actually explored a cold biome before. This is an area where you usually... Oh, wait, is this where you hatch? What is this? Oh, yeah, yeah. We could hatch something here. What is that? Why? That does not look safe. Can we, can we hatch this here? What the heck? That's the thing that's dropping those? Oh, it's making the... Okay. I think if you carry these around, you'll stay warm. It's like a little heating thing, and that creature heats them up. So guys, yes, this, I'm telling you guys, there is like no gaming world I've seen in the recent past that is anything like this. It is freaking insane. Right now, I think we're good though with the cold, because we ended up getting these little, uh, these furry coats. And that's what I was telling you guys about the evolution side of things. Wait, should we just ride this along the way? It's a little bit dangerous. Oh, oh that's a proper egg. If I pick up that egg, we can hatch a new friend. There we go. Now check this out. Oh wait, I can still float too! So if we bring this here, it will hatch another Trebum. And we need to figure out what's going on in this area. Why did it give me a sneak peek? Oh, and by the way, you can change the name, or the name of these little guys. We're gonna name this one Tiny. Alright, a new family member joined the group. The question is, what are these? Alright, these are just food. So the game did tell me I needed to eat. Alright, we're eating, we're filling up our tummies. There we go. You know guys, aliens gotta eat too, okay? What is going on with this music? Oh, do we need to give a fur coat to this little guy? I think we do. Okay. Have you have you consumed one of these yet? Oh no, he's freezing. Or she, actually. I think it's a she. Alright. Now I don't have any sort of floating things for this one. Those creatures are obviously dangerous. But really, the game doesn't tell you ahead of time what's safe and what's not. What is that? It's like some ice worm down there. You guys see that? What the heck? All right, we're gonna move. We gotta figure out what this whole place is all about. Usually there's temples to find. Hi. Okay, these, um... These make you where you create water, I think? Ooh, no, no, that's actually... Give me health. Oh, God. Yes, yes, okay. So this one can now extract water out of ingredients. Ooh! No, 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 no. What is this one? Oh, this is a heat gem. Okay, never mind. Now, if we cross through this blue boundary... Oh, no, we did. <gasps> no! We started the roll! This whole world's gonna end here in a second. Or this part of it, at least. I didn't mean to do that. We might have missed something. I'm telling you, there's a lot to explore. In each of these areas. Oh, God. Okay, these ones, guys. What do you think this is all about, huh? What do you think? Hi. Okay, yep, yeah, it's a giant mouth. If you didn't guess that one right, and it will legit eat you. Oh man, I hope I didn't miss out on little treble or tre trebums. There's something in there. No, we're not gonna get it. Look at what happens to the world when this thing rolls. Just like we saw on the other side. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, guys, this is where you, why you always look where you're going. Um, do I have a filter trunk? Oh my god, we're gonna die. If I can't get out of here now, we're dead. No! 
Okay, well guys, I'm telling you, this game can be unforgiving, okay? <laughs> Never drive your Trebum when the world is ending and you're not looking where you're going, okay? There's something over here that looked mighty, mighty good before. It's over there in that in that little uh, little building. Go! Oh no, how do I get him out? No! No! Oh, you need to unlock him with certain parts. Okay, well, I don't think we're gonna free him. If you guys ever make it to this area, please do me a favor and do not make the same mistake I did. Also, what is that thing? What is that thing? I'm seeing all these creatures I've never seen before. All right, we gotta go. This time, I'm not dropping in the gasoline. Or the, the gas. We're not gonna make the same mistake twice. Oh my god, it's catching up. You see how just everything, I mean literally nothing. Nothing is saved. Oh god. Okay, there's some sort of forest here. What I need to do is I need to find a, a location that has a, a like a, a barrier tower. Look for food, do you need to eat? Yeah, I'm trying. I'm, I'm rolling slow because I, I don't have any food in my belly. God. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so close. It's so close. There's a tower. I see it. I see the tower. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go, 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 go. No, this is not the time to stop rolling. Oh. Come on, come on. Activate, activate. Oh. That was so close. Oh my god. So I forgot to tell you guys a little detail. Whenever you cross through the, the blue beam, alright, so these towers project a beam. Whenever you cross through, the rolling starts again. So I can see the next towers in the distance. I need to find, uh, I need to find something to eat though, and I can't have that one eat the stuff. Okay, come on. Is there anything here that's edible? Because my little guys are starving. Oh, right here, right here. These little cacti. Oh, thank god. There we go. Oh, what are these? See, that's the thing about this game. You always explore things. What are, are these like space potatoes? I, th I think we got ourselves a space potatoes. This is gonna fill us up pretty good. Oh yeah, our stomach is full now. Oh hell yeah. All right, what is this? All right, these are new, I think. Hey, we're evolving. Extracts more water from the food that the Trebham consumes. Okay. Nice. Well, what is this? Oh my god, we have a flame. What? We could light things on fire? That's so cool. We can actually make fire now. I like it. What, what is this one? All right, analytical eyes. You can attack creatures and add them to your compendium. Then you can find out important information about their behavior and origins. Okay. With this new pair of eyes, the Trebum felt... Well, to be perfectly honest, they felt rather silly. But despite that, the <gasps> oh, voice no! in their minds no! told them... With no! these eyes, they could Let learn go! much about the creatures they encountered. The voice was glad about this. It was knowledgeable in the manner of animals. And now it could contribute its wisdom to their memories. What the heck is going on, guys? For real. So what else is around this area? There's got to be something that's that's very relevant, very si significant, a power that's going to help us in some way. Hi. We got some little fishies in here. Now the fish, I, I don't think that these replace your ability. I could be wrong. But I think this one's gonna let us swim faster. Oh yeah, we got webbed feet now. Oh, that's new. That snail. Hi. You good? He's not afraid of me. Oh no! Okay. This thing I would like to learn more about. The Omnigram. Run, 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 run. Oh my god, no. Go! Don't let him eat you! 
Oh, this what's time, that? The Trevum knew what they were feeling. Here was another servant of the cylinder. But what shape would this what? creature's evil take? What it is that? They seem interested in the Trevor. The servant of the cylinder had released a swarm. Small parasites had come from within it and attached themselves to the creatures of this area. It was somehow using them to corrupt the tower. Oh, to turn no. its protective force into a trap. All Trebum hate parasites by nature, and they hated these even more. They would have to remove them, but how? That's what I want to know. Clean its teeth. Clean its teeth. Oh God! Oh! Oh! How do I? How do I kill that thing? Oh my God! Is is my? Is my Trevum gone for good? Or can I revive him? He's gone! No! I thought I could revive him! Okay, we gotta figure out a way to kill that thing. I cannot believe that just happened. What are these? We got hard nuts. Oh! Oh! Okay! The nuts! Right, come on, buddy. You gotta eat, too. Alright, let's go. Are... Are you... Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. And they hated these even more. They would oh. have to remove them. But how? Oh, I know. Oh, I know how. We gotta squirt them off. Squirt off the parasites. Okay, get back down here. What? <gasps> what? Are you, are you kidding me right now? It slammed and killed my friend. We got it. We got it. Roll away. Roll away. Give me that crystal. Can we revive our friend? Oh no, we lost him! Really? Oh wait, no, 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 he's here! Yes, yes, yes! We got him back, let's go, let's go! Oh my god! So we gotta, we gotta blast off all the viruses and all these creatures. Even though they're very dangerous. Oh god, we gotta keep eating too. We gotta have full tummy so we can get away if we need to. Oh my god. There we go. We got that one. There's one more on it. There's still one more. There we go. We got them both. Okay, I want that. I want that. I don't know what it does, but I want it. Run, 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 run. Okay, we gotta go. How many more are there? These little creatures, man. Okay, there's still some more. Oh my god, these slammers are so dangerous. We need to trick them into slamming. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I went into the mouth of the other one. We got it, we got it. Run, run, run. Okay, so there's there's ground ones, and then and then there's flying ones. Got it, got it. Oh, jeez. What happened? Okay, wait, wait, how do I do this? We want to free this little guy, too. We need six green eggs. And two... Oh, okay. If we get six green eggs, we could get this guy free. There's two. We got it. Oh, no, he was hiding. Okay, let's see what happens. I've never actually done this before. Give. Yes! We got a new little guy, too! Let him keep his name. Hi! Add into the family! Oh, boy.
boy, guys. The cylinder's gonna start rolling the second we walk through this. This is it. Let's go. I'm probably missing something, but I just want to see what's next. Oh. It's gonna start moving. There it is. Oh my god, it looks so sinister. Okay, this is our last opportunity to go see if there's anything that's worth getting. Alright, we scoped out that, that shelled grawlisk! Oh no, get out of there guys, get out of there! He's got a nest! Tiny, no! We lost Tiny! Oh my god, dude, that thing's- that thing is hauling booty. I gotta get to this now. No, 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 no! No! It's going so fast! Why is it going so fast? Why is it going so fast? Um... Did I lose my whole family? Did I- Did I actually lose my whole family? Just- just be honest with me. Are they all gone? Oh my god, they're waiting for me. You guys... The ultimate pranksters. Whoa, 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 whoa. No way! No way, it's going again! What's happening? Oh my god, it's so beautiful! It's so beautiful! What is that thing in the sky? It's holding it back, guys. Whatever that is, it's holding it back. We're gonna keep moving. I don't know what causes that, but it, but it's working. That is so cool. Wow. That is insane. Oh, we could free something here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't have what you need. I don't have what you need, I'm sorry! See, this is- this just goes to show you, this game's got things that you can 100% unlock, you might even miss out on. Make sure we have a little snack break. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go to the next tower. God, it's so beautiful though, guys, isn't it? Okay, next tower's all the way up here. Whoa, 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 am I gonna get struck? The eternal cylinder is producing an electric barrier that you cannot cross. Outrunning the lightning strikes is not possible, but... Also, what is this? What are these? That's something new, right? Or is that fire? Oh yes, yes, we've got fire. Oh, wow. A Gargand? What is that? Are you- are you hostile? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh my god, it goops. And it whips. It goops and it whips. I don't know what else to do here. There was- did you guys see that ship in the sky before, by the way? Oh no! What? What the hell was that about? You are not killing my little guys. Where, where's my other guy? Where is he? Where'd he go? We're down to two! Oh my god, I can't believe we got struck by light lightning. Alright, we did it. Oh, the whole world, guys, it's all ending. Isn't it beautiful, though? Look at the, the mountains break. Just crumble away. Oh my god, I love watching this, by the way. This is so cool. It's so cool! <laughs> We need more destruction in games like this. Everything breaks, guys. Everything. Oh, man. 
It's time to go in. Look at the tower fall. Oh. Alright. Well, guys. I've been having fun playing this. I think you guys would like it a lot too. Again, be sure to click that link down below. This is the Eternal Cylinder. I really want to know what this is all about, right? And I'm telling you guys, the world's freaking beautiful. My god, there's a temple over there. You know what, I'll, I'll show you guys the temple real quick. You occasionally find these temples and they're like relics from olden times. Hey, I found the entrance. Let's go in. We're going into the temple. The Trepham Shrine. Oh, wow. This place made the Trebum uncomfortable. It felt like a place of desperation, where terrible, bitter things had happened a long, long time ago. Oh, no. That's like a locked-in desert biome. So this, these little temples are usually a, a part of the game where you've got to figure something out. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, where are we going? Okay. I roll. Unfortunately, I don't think I could stay on this. Oh, wait, maybe I can? <gasps> no! Okay, okay, okay. This is edible and this will upgrade us. The mixer. The mixer mutation allows the Trebum to combine specific ingredients to create offensive projectiles that could be launched. What? There was something strange about this new body, the Trebum thought. It was powerful, but also a little frightening. They now had the ability to mix ingredients in order to create projectiles with which they could attack other Whoa. creatures. This new power might be necessary for their survival. But they would have to make sure to use it carefully, so they would never become as cruel as the servants of the cylinder. Okay, okay. Also, why do I feel like you could technically ride this thing up to the top? I bet you there's an Easter egg up here somewhere. Alright, so how do I mix my projectiles? Well, that's definitely not it. Oh, God. Oh god, are we mixing right now? I, I think I just crafted something. Oh my! <gasps> oh, that's one way to do it! Wow! So now we can actually craft, like, ammunition. Are you serious? Whoa. Oh, now we have sucker feet! What? Now we know what to do with this part, right? So we jump up here. We go on up. Oh, ha, ha, ha. All right, sucker down. Oh, I was gonna make that. Is this it? Oh, yeah. Oh, and there's a treasure here. Guys, this is one of those games that always pays to explore. We're gonna find something special in here. Okay, we should be able to leave the temple. All right, guys. I think this is probably a good place to end this episode. Very, very cool game. Like I said, I it's probably one of the most unique games I've seen in years. And I'm still trying to figure out what exactly is going on in this world. I feel like I'm just barely scratching the surface of the story. But if you guys want to see more of this sometime, let me know, guys. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite part of this game is, if this is a game that you might even end up picking up for yourself. Link down below. And thank you to the Eternal Cylinder for sponsoring this video. You can pick it up now. Oh god, okay. That thing is trying to sniff me and I don't like it. You know what? Hold on. Merry Christmas. You don't, it only took one? Oh my god. There's something there I could suction. Oh. Come here, come here. Alright, what does this do? It's gonna evolve us like a whip or something. Alright, causes damage to the eyesight. Are you kidding? 
The game literally punishes you <laughs> for destroying a, a neutral creature. All right. Oh, God. Well, I started a cylinder. Anyway, guys, thank you again for watching this episode. This is a game I could definitely see myself streaming more of, too. But yeah, let me know. Leave a like as we watch the world end. Oh, we can watch the temple break. Uh, oh, God. No, 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 no. Flying creatures. I'm just trying to watch. Oh, there it goes. No! Okay, this is bad. Um. Yeah. Wait, is it slowing down? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, sometimes it loses momentum if it's got to break, like, something huge. And then it gets going again. Anyway, we got to go to this tower. Can you not? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's picking up steam. It is picking up steam. Yeah, it's time to go. Oh, of course. Of course. No, 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 no. Are you kidding? No! No! We're not gonna make it! Oh, Jesus Christ! Where's the thing? Oh! Wait, are we? Yeah, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. Oh my God. Look at that. Oh. Anyway, guys. That's gonna do it for this one. Thank you again for watching. Leave me a comment, leave me a like. Again, this was the Eternal Cylinder. Very, very cool game. And I've only seen just a little bit of the unlock so far. 50 mutations, they say. 50! Along with four diverse biomes. And I feel like we've only seen like a couple of them. Wait. Uh-oh. Uh, the strangely named evil giant was back. What was he hunting for? What oh, come on. What monstrosities would he summon this time? I don't know. Uh, uh, uh. What? The hell was it? He just pumped the land with something. Oh, God. Okay, guys. I don't want to spoil anything. But we're going to let him go off. He's hopping back over the cylinder. He just injected the land with some sort of poison or something. Oh, man. Alright, guys. For real, though, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. And again, be sure to click that link down below. This has been The Eternal Cylinder. I'll catch you guys all next time.